Hi, this is going to be a video just to show the functionality of the Satec X52 flight control system. Basically, just going to show you that all the buttons work so that uh, you can feel comfortable buying this in the eBay auction. So I'll go through. There's a lot of buttons to show, and uh, I don't have the software to play uh, any flight games, but I can show you using the device drivers and the calibration tools that come with the system. These can be downloaded from the Satec website, by the way. So let's see, there's the x-axis, y-axis, and uh, I'm, I'm just, I'm using the controller here, and you can see that the controls are being registered on screen. Point of view hat one. Point of view hat two. And let's see, point of view hat three, where's that one at? Right there. Precision slide. Mouse X and Y. And the mouse click. There's the mouse wheel scroll. Fire E is what that's called. Fire D. Clutch button. I've already done that one. Oh, there's the throttle. Uh, let's see, now, there's also three function buttons. I don't see those making an adjustment on the screen, but if you look over here where the mouse is wiggling, you'll see that it's lighting up. There's one, there's one, there's one. fire button. Okay, the, the top trigger, there are two triggers on this. Um, there's a, this is the top trigger and a pinky trigger. The top trigger actually has two switches on it. If you pull just a tiny bit, it triggers. And if I pull completely, second trigger. And then the pinky trigger. You can see it, it's up here, it says mode one pinky. There's a mode button that you can pivot, and you'll see it switches up here. It says mode 2, mode 3, 2, 1. I think that pretty much covers everything. Um, there's more information uh, in the auction listing. Pretty radical system. Uh, I'm going to point the camera down at one thing. There is uh, this little display and that's part of the throttle control. Now, there's a sticker, a protective sticker on top of that because it's never been peeled off. And there's also a display underneath it. And you, you can look carefully. Let's see. zoom in just right. And you'll see the mode switch. I guess it's kind of hard to get the angle just right. Um, but the light up display is working. And it's also displaying uh, information sort of behind the, the glass here. It's just not showing up on the camera, but it does work. I guess on that part, you'll have to take my word for it. Um, this thing's been used like one time. I think we just used it more demonstrating this for the auction than we have used it <laughs> ever since we've owned it. Uh, it's overkill for our kind of gaming. So uh, time to pass it off on eBay, and uh, hopefully it's something that you'll be interested in. Thanks for watching.